Dazzle, thanks for coming and hanging out with me today. Today we are doing Don't Scarf. Oh, we got a echo again. One day, one day I'll remember to check that. Just a, it's a little, it's a little clicky click, and then it makes everything sound perfect. And I, and I usually forget the clicky click. It's fine. Everything's fine. <sighs> So hello everybody, thanks for coming and hanging out with me today. I'm gonna to be playing Don't Starve, and with any luck, we're gonna build some epic Bodhi things because we're gonna to try to do the um, dragonfly stuff that I don't know anything about and I've never done, so I have no idea how it's gonna go. And the disclaimer is that my last time that I tried boating, well, it burned to a crisp and sunk to the bottom of the ocean. So we'll see how it goes this time. Hopefully we can keep our boat afloat. That would be a huge improvement from last time. So hello everybody. Hi Ofek and hi Rippy. How you guys doing today? Thanks for coming. If you would like to join us, you can do that. You just gotta go over to the Discord and into the Don't Starve channel is a pinned comment that tells you how to join the server game. Everybody's welcome. Just well, be prepared for Whatever it is that that this is. Because, well, things never quite go as intended. Alright, I, I have just a smidgen of food to my name. Well, I'm supposed to be eating that, not cooking it. That's fine. I just totally ate that hunk, like, raw. Uh, no chaos mode today. We don't do so much, uh, we don't do chaos mode every time because I have found that people don't tend to have the cakes for it. <laughs> it, it it's that problem of uh, people needing to have time to save up for the fun of all of it. At some point I will eventually figure out what the balance is, like what's a good amount of time in between the chaos events to let people like accrue points so that they're not just like oh i wish i wish i could do the thing i don't know what that balance is yet even remotely i mean i suppose the other option is just to always have it on and running and then um let people kind of decide and figure it out for themselves but oh, i guess i had a carrot And if we run chaos, we can't be on the server because that's like mean to run chaos that can like absolutely wreck a world on a world that people have been collaboratively working towards. So, you know, it, it's, it's trying to figure out the balance of things. Don't know what that is, but you know, trying. I have such random crap in my pockets. I don't I don't know why I have this crap in my pockets, but we're gonna start with dumping this crap into chests so that it's not in my pockets. And then I have to figure out what I'm doing in order to uh, do the stuff for the things. Oh my gosh, why do we have so many beefalo home? And we got a whole bunch of rock walls. I know why we have a bunch of those. We did an experiment and then we blew it up and it was pretty fun. Oh my goodness, I have too much stuff. All right, let's see what it takes to make four gold and some boards. All right, we're bound to have some gold here somewhere. If not, I'm gonna go mining.
So that's the boards. I'm probably gonna need a pick at this rate, because, well, not seeing any of the other stuff. Alright, over here. I have chests everywhere. There's no organization. It looks like I have what we need. So that's something. We're gonna put this shrine down here next to our Christmas stuff. I don't know, because we can. Alright, so then in theory, we need to have boat stuff that we, like, give it? I don't, I don't know how this works. Have I died yet? Not yet, but give it time, Uthgar. The death thing will happen. I'm, I'm confident of this. Alright, so I need actually an axe. Rather than a pig. It's fine. We're gonna go cut some wood. And then we can make our thing that will let us make um, the thing that will let us make boats. Well, thank you, Mira the Dimwit. I appreciate the support. How you doing tonight? Yeah, it sneezes. Am I cutting the wood in the morning? You know, whatever time, it just happens. You just you just go with the natural urges and, and, and don't focus too much on specific time frames. Otherwise, you just, like, wreck the mood. And ugh, who needs that? Oh, it's not morning wood. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 uh... Moonlight wood. Did I already go through both of my freaking? I did. Yuck. How much do I need? Like more. So let me go get some more tree cutting crap. Like. I need either an axe or um, flint so that I can make an axe. And I know that I have flint. Apparently I don't have to tick to stick to my name. That's fine. Everything's fine. We'll just... Oh my goodness, I open this up thinking that's where the flint is and I just find more axes. That that's that's great. Like this is this is how my organizational system always works. I think, oh I don't have a thing, so I make another thing. And then realize that I had 50 of them just in another box, so I didn't see the thing. This also happens to me in real life. So I end up with a lot of the same item. It's fine. I mean, like, I thought I had. No, I don't. Okay. And then I come back with the thing, and sure enough, I had the thing. It's fine. Yeah, you little tree demon. Find somewhere else to, like, plague people. I, I'm, I'm busy trapping your, your possible babies. I don't want to muck with the little tree demons. And the tree demons spawn that they pop out. Ugh. Oh my Jesus, really? Tree demons everywhere. What? What? It's just downright rude.
it looks like the, 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 the evil tree spirits are gonna like fight each other and I'm all for that you guys go at it god damn it I can't dodge nothing to save my soul just for the record It's raining, but that doesn't look good. Can you like bonk on the tree and, and get it for me? I could I could really use that. Assistance. Let we just see if we can get a better fight going on between the two of them. I know this surprises all of you, but I'm in danger. <sighs> I don't know if this umbrella actually protects me from this rain, but I'm gonna try, man. It's not likely to make it worse. Let me Dr. Pepper drinks. I thought I didn't have a can, but I had several all over the room alone. Yeah, yeah. It's just everywhere. I can't spawn help for you, unfortunately, due to no button. Yeah, it's not a chaos night because we're playing on the server. Can't go like wrecking what other people are, are building, guys. That's that's not cool. Let's just uh, get a little bit of sleep, and then we can use our food to restore our food so that we're, we're, our sanity and health are better. <sighs> Good thing that I have these spider nests to like crawl into and I can cuddle with my spider friends. That actually sounds like we'd be a really horrific experience. You, gar you, you get into this like tight, dark place and there's these little crawlies all over you while you're trying to sleep oh that would be awful Blah. do not recommend the idea of actually sleeping with the spiders that sounds like it would be horrific don't do it I wasn't going to wreck anything. I wanted to spawn help before the trees wrecked you, but knowing us, it would be on fire as well. Exactly. That's all I'm getting at. It's like the minute I engage the chaos option, things in the world start blowing up inevitably. Not even that people are trying to. A lot of times it's because I'm an agent of chaos and you add chaos on top of the chaos. And it's like chaos squared that exponentially ignites the world on fire. I think that's really what happens. But the spiders are friends. Um, they are, but they're not in real life. They're just in this make-believe world where I can sort of like delusionally imagine that they actually look like they do in this. They don't. They just, they just don't. Not enough food in my character's life, by the way. Okay, then we're gonna put, what is that? An animal track? I don't even know that I want to know what that is. 
If I follow that, it would probably lead to my demise. Can you can you build the thing? Ooh, thank you. All right, now we need a little bit of fuel. Doesn't really matter what. And then there's bound to be some poop. I always have poop. No, really? No poop in my life? How do I have no poop? Didn't I just have poop in my pocket that not long ago? I'm telling you, man. Are you doing the boast race here? I'm 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 trying. Just doing it on hard mode. I am. <laughs> Ignorance is bliss. Yeah, something like that. We we have more resources here and stuff. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure it'll be fabulous. Nothing could go wrong. I'm pretty sure that it doesn't matter where I try to build boats, things are gonna go wrong, but I'm gonna do what I can do, and yeah. All right, I clearly need to go on a gathering of food mission, because I have like nothing to eat. I probably have some in my uh, food box. I should look at my lunch box, see what I got. Oh look, we had a boat thing here and I already made another one. Look, see what I'm talking about? That's not what I wanted to put in there. I don't wanna put the fuel in there. I wanna put the web in there. Boy, all right, let's see what I have in my lunch box. That'll at least get me till long enough to uh, make some more stuff, more food stuff. But I need to start by cutting the trees down to get the nuts, because those are pretty much like the easiest thing. At least that's the theory and I'm sticking to it. Did you do the offering already? By more resources, you mean we could take Templar stuff here? Um, I have not done the offering already. And by more resources, Templar stuff, you know, maybe if we need it. But for the record, I, I, I have stuff too. Hey Zebra, did you hear what the Buffalo said to his son before he went to practice? The father said, bye son. Wow. 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 Wait. Listen, psycho bird, stop trying to barf on me. Like, I'm just walking by. Why is there varmint birds? Like, who decided that was a good idea? Assholes. That's what they are. They're bloody assholes. Apparently there's just like a whole shit ton of stuff down here and I can just put a bunch of it in my pocket and we're gonna be great. Because it's gonna take a lot of wood to make um, boat stuff. I thought I was going to have to like Top wood for it, but here we are where the wrecking has happened. This is probably where Berger like storms through. He's pretty good at just like wrecking the place. Bloody asshole and vomiting. Yeah, they need to be checked. They totally do. There's nothing good about these birds. It's not healthy, it's not normal, it's not okay. They need to be evicted. And if that means by sending them to the doctor, I'm okay with that. That's a perfectly good alternative to having them here barfing on me.
All right, let's get a little bit of food stock because I have none. I'm done, guys. Get a med bill so they have a heart attack and die or blood loss, whichever comes first, right? Give them something to worry about other than myself. That seems legit. Because they seem hyper fixated on me for no good reason. I haven't even burned any trees yet. I mean, come on. I mean, you know I will, but I haven't yet, so it doesn't count. They're just like, I don't know, profiling me and being like, oh, she looks sketchy. We gotta, we gotta like nerf her. And I'm just like, but I just, I just showed up. I haven't done a thing. There's a plant being an asshole. Everything in this world. Bunch of assholes. <laughs> Everything in this world has a condition in which it will murder you. That it just it just won't have any qualms. It'll just be like, yep, you're gonna you're gonna be done now. Last time Zebra set something on fire, current time, 25 minutes, what? I don't know what weird event is happening right now, but. That's the scientist from uh, the first game. It looks like it is location dependent, so I'll just not be there. Um, nope, it looks like it's followed me. Alright, that's, that's fine. I love it when things just get weird and follow me and I don't know how to, like, not die by whatever it is. Like, what's that weird floaty ball coming my direction? Please don't murder me. Like, go away. Whatever it is that made you, like, come into this universe and get all weird and glowy and floaty around, I didn't do it. It wasn't me. I had nothing to do with it, sir. Just bugger off. I just want to build a boat. <laughs> Be a colonoscopy in the world of assholes? Oh, there's like a whole bunch of candy barf over here. All right. Fine, let me Google the world. <laughs> I, I knew what you meant. It's close enough. This is spelling me. Oh, it looks like Glomer got murdered a couple times. That's kind of distressing you know what's even worse I'm gonna pick up his remains and it's gonna be fine I, I they don't stack I guess I don't know what you do with his wings but we have them Nothing is safe. Nope, nope. I'm an opportunist at my very heart. Like, why let those rings go to waste? Gotta pick them up, put them in your pocket, and maybe at some point in the future, I'll figure out a thing to do with them. Maybe I can strap them on and, and like, float around or something. You never know. Wouldn't that be cool, going fly around with the strap-on wings? Hide your loot! Hide your corpses! Hide all the things! A 
this is definitely how it be. Alright, so now I can come up here and I don't I don't know what I'm doing, but there's there's some more weird tracks. Like gnarly, nasty looking tracks. I'm not following that shit. That shit looks dangerous. The normal tracks nerf me. I don't need special tracks to double uber nerf me. I mean, I'm curiosity's probably gonna get me and I'm probably gonna, you know, follow them eventually, but But first, we gotta do the boat stuff. That's the first thing on the agenda today. We're boating, and it's gonna be the boatiest boat that ever was, and we're gonna make all the boaty people envy at our boatiness. Just like last time. Where we just made the most enviable boat ever. And what we chose to do with it has nothing to do with the matter. That's our corpse collection. It's great. And I think that there are sleeping guys down here that I can pocket and nerf to make snacks. Because I definitely need snacks right now. But I can make better snacks if I have somebody to nerf. At least they've forgotten that they're mad at me at the moment. I'm okay with that. Or they decided that being mad at me wasn't worth the chaos. Oh, really? I, I get there just in time for them to wake up. <sighs> now I can't just simply pocket them. I, I have to, like, actually trap them. I have to actually put in some effort. That's what I get for walking slow. Let me grab some grass so I can make a uh, trap. So I can make some traps. So I can get some spider meat. So I can make some food. pockets right now and it's really gross but at the same time I have a crap ton of stuff in my pockets like how can my pockets be so full and still have nothing useful because I'm compulsive and I pick things up that's fine we won't actually like get it to the heart of the issue we'll just whine about it and ignore the realities it's fine put some traps down so I can like get some friends to cook with. Cooking with friends is great. Who doesn't like to cook with their friends? Food tastes better when you have friends with it. All the things that get taken out of context and make people wonder about my uh, character. 
It says you have to offer charcoal. Okay. I was just gonna start trying to like offer it things. I wasn't gonna actually like be prepared and look it up. That's definitely adds his MO. She's always like, let's be prepared. And I'm just like, mm. Seriously, the weird psychoness is coming over here now. I swear it's following me. And it just, it just needs to stop. I didn't consent. box so that it doesn't just rot in our pockets and then we need to cook these nuts you can't really do anything else with them anyway offering a charcoal to dragonfly shine will grant players access to the offerings filter where they're able to acquire event-specific items using gold nuggets or lucky gold nuggets. Apparently, it's going to give you the boat race items. Yes, that is my understanding, is that you have to, like, give it things, and then it gives you boating items that you can then race with. But that's uh, nothing I can say for sure, because I haven't really done it. That's just my understanding of how this event works. I just need to go, like, light a forest on fire somewhere, right? Which means that I first need to be able to make a torch. And I just... I don't know, chopped that tree out of spite because I sure as heck didn't get anything out of it. I mean, in all reality, I just chopped it because I was too close while I was trying to pick up the other things, but you know, that's fine. Alright, so we need some grass. There's like no grass here at all. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. There's lots of freaking sticks everywhere, though. That's where the tree demons got ganked by the other tree demons. That's the loser pile. in my boating life is that I don't actually know like for sure how much I need to give to it so I'll just like go burn down a whole forest and then we'll be sure to have enough right that's got to be a good strategy yeah I'm sure that's gonna work just fine where there's like, oh yeah, like over here where there's a bunch of trees. Where they're all grouped together so that the fire is likely to spread. And 
Or unless I didn't put one of my meatballs in my lunchbox. You don't want my meatballs getting bad. Listen, jerks. Most of these are not real trees anymore. That's not super helpful. We'll just have to, like, spread the wealth around. Charcoal. It was meant to be, guys. This, this here is the event for the pig. Anything that requires you to burn things has to be good, right? That's a great holiday. I want you to know I have no idea how many things I need, so I'm just going to make a bunch of it, and then it'll be great, right? And let's get these mushrooms while we're here so that we can make some more meatballs down the road. Because it's all about the meatballs. this charcoal. It's amazing. No, I don't need any rocks. I have such a ridiculous, like, stash of rocks. I don't know where to put all the rocks that I have, so I definitely don't need more. And yet, my character's determined to pick them up. Almost as impulsive at looting as I am. Sheesh! If you chop any trees down, the guardians come out and get all cranky. But you can, like, burn a whole swath of forest and ain't nobody caring. Like, why is it better to crispy fry the trees alive than to chop them down? Like, is that their preferred method of, like, ending stuff with fire? In which case, I approve and will accommodate. I mean, I figure if I get a whole stack, that ought to be enough to do something with, right? I don't really know the answer, but we're going to find out the answers to all the things. Definitely everything. We're going to learn all the things, guys. We will have infinite wisdom or something. I don't know. Damn it. Can, can you just plant the things? Hello, friendly neighborhood spiders. How you doing, buds? They're not, like, part of our colony, but they're colony adjacent. I mean, I don't know, though. Our stuff is getting far enough down here that they might start counting as part of our colony. Like, how close together do things have to be before they're part of the same group? I don't actually know the answer to that. So 
We give coal, charcoal. I don't know if you have to like give them all at once. Oh, you legit only had to give it one? That was it? You just you just have to give it a burnt offering and and that's it? I just figured I'd have to do it for everything that I wanted. Okay. Decked out dragonfly boat kit equipped with all the draconic fixings. A lucky gold nugget. Well, where the hell do you get lucky gold nuggets? The start tower kit. Ready, set, boat. You get gold. You gotta have gold nuggets. That one's a lucky gold nugget. Um, middle of the beast costume, the lucky beast tail. Oh dear. So we need gold. So I guess we need to go mining. And maybe tossing some stuff over at the uh, pig king. Not that I readily have anything for said Pig King, but he is also an option for getting gold. Wow, I have like no tools or anything. Oof. So I said that I have a stash, but I don't feel like I actually have an effective or useful stash. I just have a collection of shit in a collection of boxes. That's, that's what I feel is actually happening. It's fine. So apparently they also don't care if I pick up sticks. Maybe that's because it's like collecting nail clippings, right? They've fallen off. They think it's weird, but you know, it, it doesn't hurt anything. So they, they call it fine. gold in that section so it looks like we're gonna have to go up in here to get gold all right it's fine we got this and stuff and things and stuff hey all the snacks along the way. It's fine. Like, everywhere you go in the world, there's just stuff all over the ground. I think that the farther in you play, the more that becomes the case. get to where there's just stupid amounts of things just laying around all the time and my compulsive self wants to clean the world up but then you have to like find a box for it and I guys I have a problem I don't have big enough box and enough boxes that's definitely the problem Yeah, 
Oh, the sneezes. I think I lost part of my soul with that one, but it's fine. When you sneeze hard enough that it like hurts down deep in your chest, that sucks so bad. I could just totally pass on that and it would be fine. I'm beginning to feel like the gold has already been collected and I've just been shammed. Because gee, look, now that I've walked there, it's all disappeared. That's very rude. I should have known better at, like, this point in the game that it was a lie on my map. Ah, well, looks like there's a few. baby. Woo! We're rich. Rich beyond measure. What is that? Abandoned junk. Looks like the scientist just left his notes behind and you can like try to learn things from it. So there's probably no gold up there, but I'm gonna go look. I'm gonna go look. Cause you know, I'll definitely not find anything if I don't go and look. Looking is required to see, to see the things. It's too bad that it just doesn't keep my map completely updated at all times with accurate information just because I want it to. It should totally do that. What the hell is that? me you asshole this is this is very rude stop spitting at me nobody nobody wants to be spit at that's so gross dude ah oh, god damn it Apparently I can't attack when I'm in that goo. How the hell do I dodge that? What the hell are you, you fuzz bucket? He looks like dryer lint. He's kicking my ass. This this hostile dryer lint is gonna end me. I think I need to run away from the lint. Listen, jerk. I just wanted the gold, all right? Like, why you gotta be like that? It's because there's hostile lint up here that there's still gold up here. I know the truth of it now. Well, there, I, I've eaten every bit of food I had in my pockets, and I have a little bit of life to my name. And hopefully he's the only hostile lint out here. Freaking jerk. I wasn't expecting the floof to get up and like spit at me. What was that all about? I mean, I should know better. Everything in this world, man. Hostile, nasty, and I had to get ya. 
They're just they're just always out to get you. That's that's the default assumption I should make. I know better. But then my curiosity gets me and I'm all like, oh, what is this thing? I've never seen it. I'm gonna go look at it. Maybe it'll be a new friend. Nope, nope, it will not. It will not be a new friend. It'll be a new hostel that'll find a new and creative way to kick your ass. I don't think that it should be called Don't Starve Together. I think that it should be called like, I don't know, Hostile Creatures Abound or something. Being enemy number one. Something. I'm trying to skirt around the, the lint. I'm not sure exactly where he is, so that's a problem. And I don't think that I have very many, like, hits left. something that we can give to the pig king. And well, giving the pig king stuff means getting gold, so that's good. Because apparently that's that's what we're doing now. It's spending lots of gold on boat bits. I don't know how to get the lucky gold though. We'll have to figure that out. Maybe you get lucky gold from like doing race things. I mean that seems reasonable. One of the things about doing these events is that there's no, like, to-do list or script. You just gotta, like, fuck about and see what happens, and... I feel like that's kind of don't starve all around, though. This game doesn't, like, give you any clue. It's just like, here you go! Poof! Like, really being dropped in this, this landscape, and you have to figure it out. I, I could definitely use a built-in tutorial. But that's my preference with every game. And so few of them actually give it. And then I'm like spending the beginning part of the game always being lost and confused. I mean, who am I kidding? I'm always lost and confused the whole duration of the game. But that's besides the point. And it's for different reasons. So it's different, right? I mean, totally different. Not the same at all. Oh my goodness. I have no idea how much gold it's gonna take to like get a reasonable amount of things, so I'm just getting gold. And I don't know where that hostile dryer lint went, but to be getting close to where he was. Maybe he's buggered off. Okay, I need to go a little bit more or this way, and then theoretically that will be all the gold there is. So it'll have to be enough gold. How much we get is gonna have to be good enough. I mean, that's what it is. I 
Good thing there's lots of flint over here too, so that we can like just keep making the picks that we're going through. I wanted a little nugget of meat. <sighs> I guess I smashed him too vigorously with my sword and lost all, all meat. So much for that bird nugget. Well, there's the angry uh, dryer lint. He can just say right there. Nasty, nasty! It's a Mr. Nasty! Well, I have a little bit of boring food anyway. I mean, come on, eating ice is like super duper nutritious. Refreshing, invigorating. Yeah, cools you down and stuff. I did not need the pine cone. I was just trying to get the mushrooms and some sticks. Because I have managed to use a bunch of sticks and I don't want to have to like go stick hunting later because I'll inevitably have to do so. So if I just collect them on the way, it's it's less work, right? Yeah, yeah. It's definitely less work if you stop and pick up everything in sight than if you only go selectively hunting for the one thing. Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's my story. I'm sticking to it. You can prove nothing. See what we can uh, see what we can do here. Can I put this on my tree? No. All right. That would have been funny to have a spider decoration on my Christmas tree. It would have amused me greatly. I feel robbed now. Like, that could have been something great, and it just wasn't. Alright, let's make our pasties so that we have things to eat. Fawn haunches, even haunches, guys. We're gonna we're gonna have haunches, which you apparently can't see underneath his other tentacle dress. It's fine. Good 
because it definitely doesn't look like I changed my outfit at all. Oh, I need to put my eyes away. My eyes will go bad. I'll put it away. All right. It's time for a snack. All right, all right, all right. I get it. I just put them all away. Eat a whole bunch of ice and then we can like go pop into the nest and rejuvenate the rest of ourselves. It's like a super nap. I definitely never get to sleep as well in real life as I do in these games. Huh. I never wake up with, like, my brain and heart full. Does anybody ever have sleep like that? I think that that's definitely part of the make-pretend of the imaginary worlds, that that kind of sleep is even possible. I like how it wiggles with your snoring. Or at least I'm going to presume that's why it wiggles is because you're snoring. I mean, it could be that I'm just in there trying to get all the little spiders crawling on me off me while I'm sleeping. That could be what it's all about too. But that doesn't seem like a intense and vigorous enough of a wiggle. Let's figure out what we're doing. Ready, set, boat. Okay. Achieve ocean dragonhood. Okay. A little known fact about dragonflies, they're surprisingly good swimmers. I think the rest of this stuff takes the special gold that I don't have any of. Okay. I'm gonna make another box so that I can put my gold somewhere and um because I don't want the molds to come along and eat it that's what they do man molds are evil all right so I can put away my pick I don't need that theoretically and then we just have to, like, pick a place to go to the ocean, right? Which is, like, right up here. And we can just, like, plunk in our boat and see what happens, right? Like, what could possibly go wrong? Except for that we know the answer. We know what can go wrong. We can help build it. Should we start here? How about there? What? What is... I don't know what this is. All right. I have a starter boat, I guess. What just 
happened? I don't I don't know what we're doing. But I feel like I'm gonna need more than one ore. I've learned my lesson with this already the last time. We definitely needed more than one ore. Oh, I need my gold back. Okay, let's see if I can make other Bodhi things. I don't, I don't know. A boat patch probably wouldn't be a bad thing, but I don't know if I have any, I don't think I have any stingers. means I'd have to go, like, get these. Which is always an interesting task. I have hit and miss bee adventures. With a lot more miss than hit. Listen, assholes, I'm just getting into my chest. You guys were gone. I need to, like, Get rid of you again. Ah, <sighs> so annoying. Alright, so where are the bees? I don't even know what some of this shit is. What is that sitting there next to the road? I don't know, guys. That's the answer. I don't know. When it comes to most of this stuff, the answer is I don't know. I don't see that there are any beehives anywhere on this map. That's that's fine. Feel 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 like a bad girl. That's unfortunate. Exceptionally, exceptionally unfortunate. Okay. Why are you last? What are you looking for? I was looking for I was looking for bees. Um and I see like a few right there. That's it. That's we got we got minuscule bee family in our world. Alright, I'm off to like get some bees. have your own bees in this world? I thought so, but I'm not seeing them. I wonder if they met with the demise. I thought they were in here somewhere, but I don't see the bee box. I don't see it. I think that we are bee boxless. Um, sad. Somebody crashed! <laughs> Look, we'll just pick up that candy cane that's laying in the rotted eggs. It's fine. Yay, candy canes! We won't ask any questions. We'll just eat the candy that's laying on the ground in the middle of rot, and it's going to be tasty, and we're going to love it, and it's perfect, and could possibly be anything weird or untoward about it. It's fine. Candy canes are amazing, especially the blue raspberry ones. You know, the candy that always makes your mouth bright blue when you're done eating it is absolutely the best candy ever.
I'm sure that they don't have to put so much dye in it that your like mouth is blue for 10 days, but they sure do. I mean, they don't really have to put any dye in it, but for some reason, they need to make it blue. I mean, I ain't never actually seen a blue raspberry. They've all been red, but what do I know? Maybe it's the exotic formula. Now the bees are sleeping, so I have to wait until daytime. Ugh. We got some snacks. Gave us something to do while we waited for the night to go by. I mean, it's seven meat that I didn't have before, so that's not bad. And getting them will keep them from, like, coming down and mucking with the bees while I'm trying to uh, get them. Oh man, he just got my helmet. There you go. <laughs> Rip. Well, there's one death for the day. I mean, I'm like an hour in and I've only had one. That's actually doing pretty good. <laughs> Let's be honest, there's bound to be something that's gonna nerf me. It's kind of an inevitability. I don't think that it is possible to like play this game for hours and hours and hours and not die. I, I just, I don't think that it'll ever be my uh, game experience. I mean, I guess if I just left my character in one place right next to the postern. I might have a chance. I didn't explore. No, nah, because then you'd starve. See, that you, you, you just, you have to go out. They make it so that you can't just, like, stay where it's safe. I just get hungry and shrivel up. Turn into a ghost from that. Alright, and we're off. <sighs> now I have to like, go collect my corpse. My color cor cor corpse's stuff. The corpse collection. Ah! Ah, shit. Really? Really, guys? Really? There's two. 
Don't walk by the flowers when you're naked. That's my public service announcement for the day. So, yeah, there's two. We're doing great. I guess I had to get caught up because I usually die once a half an hour. Um, I'm past, past that. I haven't met my quota. <laughs> exactly, guys. That's my theme song right there. You know you ain't getting your stuff back, right? Of course I am. Of course I am. Why would you think it wasn't gonna happen? I have Stubbornness 2000. I'm going to like keep getting up there, grabbing stuff and dying on repeat until I have all my stuff in my pockets and manage to run away. Like that that's just how this goes. And you do it enough times, and eventually you just get lucky and shit lines up, and you get out of there with your stuff in your pockets. I'm telling you, winning video games through stubbornness is, is the way to go. It doesn't require anything like, you know, having skill set. Screaming little rabbits. Run for your lives! The Miscotti Spider, I shall eat you! I mean, they did a pretty good job in capturing the sound that rabbits legit make when they scream and run from you. Oh my god. If you've never heard a screaming rabbit, look it up on YouTube. It's awful. It's awful. And some breeds of rabbit are just super skittish, so that's like what they live their life doing, is just screaming in terror at their shadows. It's how they convince things, I think, not to be near them. Because they make such a horrible noise, everything's like, Why? Why you make that sound? I can't be near you! a whole day to get back over here near my corpse. Okay, now we have to be strategic here. Open. Drop. Drop. There you go. I don't need asshole bats in the mix. Stop it. No. It's not necessary! Listen, assholes! Find somewhere else! Bugger off! <laughs> Why you gotta be like that? Oh, no, wait. I want them in my backpack. Stop moving! Let me blow you up! Nah, he's not gonna stay still long enough. That's unfortunate.
Hey, this is the yo-yo collection plan. We've got this. Ah, oh, crap. But see, half the stuff is over there, so it's okay. We only have to get half the stuff we got before. And hey, guys, I'm back to my average. I've been playing an hour and a half. I've died three times, you know. We quickly did a course correction there, didn't we? The game was like, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. What's happening? What you you haven't been dying? Wait, no, we gotta we gotta we gotta correct that. And it it, it corrected it. And now I'm like on nerf mode again. It's fine. Who wants to live forever? Apparently not Weber. He does not want to live forever. He's content with, like, I don't know, recycling clones. Um, apparently we do, in fact, have some B-boxes, and they just don't look like mine anymore. Looks like, it looks like there's some B-boxes over here. It's fine. Which means that I didn't have to go on this crazy quest to start with. It's fine. At this point, I just I just have to get my stuff back, and then we can come back and make a net, and a bee hat, and we can just get from our bee box, right? It'll be great. Everything's gonna be awesome. We're not gonna have any more problems. I'm sure. I'm sure that it's gonna be smooth sailing from here. It's gonna be fantastic. I mean, we've already collected half the stuff we've dropped, so we're doing good. Telling myself that because I have to. Keep your tongue to yourself, sirs! Why always gotta be licking people? Ain't nobody asking. Ain't nobody saying, you know, I wish those frogs would lick me. I haven't been licked properly in ages. It takes sticks and web to make a net. Look, we have net stuff. How exciting. Uh, I don't know, like... Oh, we also have to have grass. Okay. I'll need some rope. Which... I suppose is fair. You gotta have something to tie the spider web onto the stick with, right? Not sure why you can't just use spider web for that, but it's fine. Don't ask too many questions. I'm sure it makes perfect sense. This is exactly how nets are made, guys. It's scientifically proven as the best net making method ever. My lunchbox is my mark, man. I mean, that seems legit. The lunchbox, it calls me. skeleton the more i die there the harder it is to like navigate i really i really think that i just might say to fuck all of it and leave the rest of it there because i'm you know that's 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 my third attempt it's fine we got most of it back it's like a lantern which is pretty easy to make some rot like who cares and some flint, which is not too bad to come by either, so we might we might just like call it a day. Because we got all the big stuff. 
It went too smoothly the first time I went in. I should have known better that there was no way that I was keeping that rhythm. And who wants a life bar anyway? That seems overrated. I mean, we gotta be a one-hit wonder, right? And I think that's the part that, like, makes this game super hard. It's like every time you die, it gets harder to stay alive. I mean, there is the option that you can change that and turn it off so that you don't lose life every time. Not gonna lie, that's super appealing. <laughs> Might do that with my next world so that I don't get, like, more squishier every time I run into something that squishes me. It's like the game is like, oh, you encountered something that caved in your face? Excellent! We'll make you squishier, so the next time when you go back to get your corpse, you'll be more likely to be nerfed than you were last time! It's splendid! You like exponentially hard, right? Let's do it! And I must, because I keep playing this game on repeat. <laughs> I have hundreds of hours in this game, so I must like exponentially difficult. There must be something, something wrong with my brain. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go hard. Yeah. And this game doesn't really have an easy mode. Like, I feel like when you change the settings and you take off things that make it hard, it just makes it harder in a different way because it makes it so that there are things that you can't get access to. Like, if you turn off the seasons, there's a whole bunch of stuff that you can only get during certain seasons that are no longer available. And same thing with bosses. If you turn off the boss and you don't defeat the boss, then you can't access things that only they drop. So it just changes the challenges. I don't think that it actually makes the game any easier. All right, let's take a look at what I actually ended up with. I think that I ended up with, yeah, like I got my sword, I got my helmet. All right, I think that I have all the like must-haves. All right, and then what does it take to make the butt bug hat? I don't remember what it's called. It's probably a bee hat or something. Yeah. I need another rope and some more net, so. I mean, some more um, web. I know we have plenty of web at the base. I just have to go get it. so I can make my rope. Wow, we've got the net. Grab one of them. Because we can make some headlights. I don't remember how it many it takes, so I'm just gonna catch them. And then I can have headlight on and not worry about burning my boat down. That seems like a good idea. You know, since I lost my lantern, get a different light source going, it's fine. It's called planning, guys. Yeah, it's called planning. 
<laughs> At least this is my bastardized version of it. <laughs> Don't judge. Not everybody can plan. <laughs> it's a skill I pretend to know how to use. <laughs> I just barely have a smidgen of life. It's very sad. Dodge those buggers. We don't need any of that. No, sir. No, sir. We do not. Okay, so I'm going to put most of this in my boxes because I don't think that you can utilize them when you are in a boat anyway. But those I will keep. Those I need. Alright, I gotta see if I can put this Halloween decoration on here. Come on, you know you, you know you want to be on there. Who doesn't want a tentacle on their Christmas tree? Now I just gotta like make myself some tentacle decorations for my, my Christmas tree so that I can live that out. Living my best life with tentacles, man. Don't ask. Perfectly normal. to be some web in here somewhere. E hat. take my food with me because I really, really don't want to like crash my boat and lose my all my things. This takes a gold and a straw hat. So I don't have, um, I think that the straw hat takes takes grass. That's the word I'm looking for. Pretty sure it takes grass. Twelve. All right. That's like a ridiculous amount. Why would it need that many? No grass. Really? Like done? Oh yeah, baby. Eight. You, you plant horror things. You're terrible. You're absolutely rotten. Wish you didn't exist. But here we are. Okay, let's make a hat. And then... No, I keep that on. Um... Ugh. They just ate my meat. My friends just came over and scarfed all my snacks. You see that shit? 
They're like, ah, oh, you're dead. You don't need it. Nom, 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 nom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's like, what, Death 5? Because of shit from the sky. All right, guys. This is this is this is gonna be okay. We're almost to the point of making our our boat trip. At least that's the lie that I'm telling myself. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do once I take said boat trip, but we're we're gonna we're gonna take it and we're gonna have a cool boat and it's gonna be awesome and I don't know things and stuff. And this backpack's mine now. Because, well, it's a backpack. And I don't, I don't want to, like... <sighs> I'm too lazy to go get more grass, guys. Oh. I figured it had, like, eaten my food, but apparently not. to have some poop that I can start a fire with. Really? Where's all my poop? Guys, I need poop. Poop saved me. Alright, it's gonna be rot that saves me this time, guys. Prepared for bee hunting. It's gonna be great. Because nothing else could possibly go wrong. It's it's gonna be perfect. Everything's gonna go smoothly. We're not gonna have any problems. And you know what they ate? They ate my meatballs. That's what they ate. Those assholes. Because <sighs> I took the meatballs out of my lunchbox so that I wouldn't drop my lunchbox on my adventure. Yep, that's definitely what happened. And I'm not sure that doing this adventure in the winter is my best option, but here we are. Will the bees not come out? Babies. Bees it's daytime, but I bet it's because it's winter. God damn it. I, I, get, I went through all of that. All of that to be able to get bees. Bees are not happening in my life. Friendly fruit fly. Alright. Hi, bud. We're gonna have to go without boat repair kits. We're just we're just gonna go in and see what happens. Cause how bad could it be, right? It's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be totally fine. Nothing could go wrong. Except for everything. But hey, don't worry about it. It'll be it'll be fine. Totally fine. box 
this with stuff that I can like yeah. put these in here and I don't know that there's anything else that we're going to be able to like make at this point I think I'm just going to have to like try this whole boating thing out and see what happens I'm sure it's going to be great happening. What am I supposed to be doing? And why can't I go anywhere? And I didn't pick up my... I didn't pick up my thing. It's fine. I'm gonna freeze my ass off because I didn't pick up my... What are we supposed to be doing? Ah! Don't, don't crash into my boat, sir! I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, I, well, what am I doing? Not that, I'm not doing that, it's fine. Hey, look, at least my boat stopped right next to shore, so I'll be able to readily hop back on even though it's leaking. It's fine, everything is fine, don't worry about it, it's gonna be great. We're still gonna be able to go on our boat. I want you to know that our first boating attempt did not go well, but it's going to be okay. We have plenty. We have plenty of boat stuff, right? We're going to we're going to be we're going to be okay. Yeah, it's going to be it's going to be totally okay. Let's let's go get some eight billion ores. Is the problem that I did just didn't pick them all up? Because I thought I had made like three or four of them. Or did they like fall into the drink when I died? In which case that'll be awkward. I don't want to bring my gold with me. That would be a disaster. Look, our boat looks great, guys. Everything is awesome. I don't know what we're doing, but... I think that we're supposed to go interact with these things. Check! It's a checkpoint! 
Okay, great. I got a checkpoint. I kind of suck at boating, just for the record. Alright, so it looks like there's one down here. So do I have to just, like, go to this one, too? riding in a boat and boat what happened um this guy this spirit guy that was boating with me totally crashed into me and made a hole in my boat and now my boat's gonna sink so i gotta get off of it oh there i go <laughs> that wasn't fast enough <laughs> i just wash up on shore somewhere <laughs> that's too funny <laughs> Our fur is soaking wet. We don't like it. At least I didn't lose both my oars. All right. I think that whatever objective I was supposed to meet, I failed to meet it. Um, it's fine. I need to get warmed up and then I need to make another stone. Uh, I thought I had put a pick in here somewhere. Can you please put the rock in front of here? Okay. It's just like, nope, I can't. Let me get some sticks so I can make another pick so I can make another rock or two. Cause at this rate, I'm gonna I'm gonna need them. As I'm probably gonna be losing all of them in the drink. Let's put these rocks here so I can pick them up later and, and have a backup plan. And then we're gonna we're gonna come over here. We need to buy a new boat because um, our boat met with mishap. And we'll buy a couple paddles because it's made all the world of difference. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And we'll have, like, one more try after this to see enough stuff for one more try, I think, to see, see how it goes. All right, we're launching! Let's get in here and let's get over to the... I suck at rowing, guys. We gotta get over here to this checkpoint, I think. I think that you have to, like, go to each checkpoint. If there's an order to them, I don't know how you tell. 
Get out of my way, dude! Okay. Come on! Come on, vote! You got this! crashed into me. That's just rude. He's a jerk. We'll ignore that I'm like mostly crazy and starving. Hey, I'm gonna hit this. The boat is crying. Yes, yes, the boat is definitely crying. Now, so am I. It's fine. All right, I think that I have enough for one more try. <laughs> this is not going good, guys. <laughs> so it looks like you have to do them in the order that it's pointing on the boat. And you gotta try to like dodge the other boater who's being a jerk and trying to crash into you. You gotta like dodge this spirit guy that is super aggressive. I like totally just haunting in the wrong direction. It's fine. All right, third time's the charm, right? We're gonna do it this time. <laughs> We're gonna get it. I'm not even really entirely sure what I'm supposed to be doing, but this time, this time's the time. <laughs> Because I'm sure round three just somehow makes it lucky. Can I get my freaking butt over here? Get warmed up. Alright, now I need to buy more boat supplies, because my boat supplies have met with demise. Yeah, because my boat has definitely sunk. Oh, maybe I can get to the... It's like right next to shore. I might be able to reach it. I think we're ugly looking. Because there's one ore and a thermal stone. Okay, I was able to get one ore, but not the other one. Ugh. All right. to those birds, but that ain't right. They look horrific. You stay over there! Don't chase me, you weirdo! You're creepy! The penguins have gone, like, zombie. Alright. Let's try the boat stuff again. Watch! We got this! Okay. 
And then we gotta wait and see what the arrow tells us. I thought it was just gonna be the same direction every time, but it wasn't. Oh, and they don't even necessarily have to do them in the same order, so it looks like the order is random. And it's better if you don't actually run into the thing. You just have to get close. He's so much better at this than I am. Struggle boating. Ah, oh, you won again. I think maybe I can still do it. Whatever it is. Hey, it looks like I won. Now I gotta like. Grab my row oars and let's see if I can get back into the land before it. Nope, not getting that oar. All right, I got one more. Okay, guys, I, I got some prizes. I'm going to go over where it's warm so I don't get distracted by my prizes and freeze. Not that anything like that would ever happen. Uh, but I'm going to need a new boat for the next race. Because this boat is is sunk. Okay, so what do we get? Unwrap. So we got one of the gold nuggets. That we need to buy other things. Alright. Alright. So if we come over here, you can get an anchor. You can get the mast. Ooh. So I'm going to need... A boat wheel kit. Okay. Let's do some things to make our boat better. But I'm going to need to make a trip to the Pig King. Because I have no more gold. Is that the only item I have for the Pig King? I thought I had something else for him. Yeah. Ah. Uh, seriously, we're getting, we're getting, we're getting batty coming. There she is, shit. Cause I forgot all about her. Where's where's my freaking spike? As she's wrecking my base. I liked my base! I didn't need you to nerf it. Listen, bitch. Okay, fine. Nerf me too. Ah! <laughs> okay, guys. Your clubs just wrecked us and is now wrecking our whole base. It's it's not okay. <laughs> I might switch over to our holiday world and see if not having all the involved stuff makes the boating stuff easier. Because I would really like to check out the boating kings. And I won one! I feel so accomplished! 
Okay, I didn't beat him. Like, I didn't beat the evil ghost guy that was chasing me down. But at least I, like, figured out what the objectives were. And how to, like, accomplish what it wanted you to. That's, like, a huge first step. If you don't know what it wants you to do, you definitely aren't going to succeed at it. Uh, so Deer Clops is just romping through my place. It's fine. Everything's fine. Listen, bitch. It's not nice. You don't need to be doing this. No, I don't want to pick stuff up. Ah, god damn it. Any chance that plant will take her out for me and I won't have to worry about it? <laughs> I've lost count of how many deaths I've had. Oi. I think I'm going to come over here and I'm going to switch over to the other world and... The, the deer clubs problem will be a future me problem because we want a boat. I want I want I want a boat. We're gonna, we, we, we made a boat. We got a boat. We did a boat thing. And then, and then deer clubs came and mucked us up and it was very rude and I didn't like it. And, um, Yeah. All right, let me. Put in the information into the discord to what I am changing to so that if anybody wants to join, they can do that. All right. And it is on the Discord. It's the world's called Boating, and the password is Boating Time with capital B, capital T. You're welcome to join if you'd like to do that. Yeah! You left to get a package. What happened? Um, Deer Clubs came and wrecked me. Absolutely wrecked me. She went, <laughs> and I went, eh! It's fine. Everything's fine, guys. Totally fine. So we're going to go into the holiday world that we were working on where we were doing all the Christmas stuff. And I'm going to see if having a world that's a little softer around the uh, uh, edges. When I wanted deer clops, no deer clops. Okay. Yeah, I know. I feel that. Like, these bosses are just like, I ain't here for your beck and call. I'm here to squish you. And you're going to like it. You're going to like it so much that you're going to come back to this game just to get a special beating for me. And you know the worst part is, is that's kind of how it, how, how it really is. Alright, we're going to drop that. So, this is our Christmas endeavors that actually went pretty well. Into my little chest. We are going to need at least a torch. And we're going to need some sticks to make some picks. And I'm going to sneeze some more. Yeah, I think the Christmas stuff is super cute. Uh, let me switch that out. And this could just be on the ground. And I don't remember where anything in this world is, so what do we got? We need to get some gold, so we're going to need to go up this way.
Well, that had like nothing on it and wasn't really worth it. That's fine. Okay. Nope. I'm and I'm I'm just heading the wrong direction. That's super useful. Super duper useful. Okay, so we need some gold. We can eat this ice, so we'll we'll do that. I have no idea when it becomes winter in this world, but there's like ice forming. So watch it be my luck that we get winter like right away. And I don't have any sticks, so I can't make any picks. Oh, <laughs> I need some sticks. Hey, sticks. I just wanted to try the boating adventures. And maybe racing my boat around will help me learn how to control it better so that I can, like, do boating things in my general game. That's, that's my thought. But it's not like, oh, an epic quest to go find a place. It's... You gotta do this little race and practice getting better at boating at the same time. Yeah, let me let me use you. You're 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 the make it faster system. Because, well, he's here. I'm going to use him. He's my bud. All right. And then mining is this way. Maybe mining is this way. Gold? Please, world, can I have some gold? Please? No? All right, it's fine. <laughs> uh, this way. I love the dramatic hop onto his back. That's the best. It takes like five gold to get going. That'll give you like a boat and then some oars. We got Berger kicking around, so if Deerclops comes along, we can get the two of them to fight, theoretically. Not a lot, but a little bit better of an idea of what I'm doing. We lost the shrine? Yeah, I think that we did. We, I think we have to rebuild the shrine. I can't remember what broke it, but... Everything set on fire. <laughs> that sounds about right.
I'm not friends with the spiders. I have to remember that. Sometimes it's like super brain disorienting to switch characters and you're like, oh yeah, I, I can't do that thing that I've been doing all along. Damn it, I left my mount behind. Badger, could you help me out? Ah shit! No! No, you're just you're just gonna you're just gonna like chill there. You could have like totally nerfed all those spiders. He's like, I could have, but what do I care? Mm-hmm. Plum pudding, okay. Where the hell is it? Uh, I don't even remember. All the way down there. I was say, I know that we didn't have our base next to the thing this time around. I usually do keep it next to the portal. You lost your beefalo friend to a misclick? Oh, what do you mean you lost him? What happened? Uh, okay. To the south! More to the south! Always more to the south! It's fine, just keep going south. Sorry guys, I'm really snotty. I don't think this congestion is ever gonna go away. I feel like this is just gonna be my new normal and it really sucks, I don't like it. But it's been forever. You attacked him by mistake? Oh no! He doesn't like you anymore. Yeah. Yeah, I, I can, yeah, he's mad at you because you punched him in the face. I mean, that kind of seems reasonable. But it is exceptionally unfortunate. But I can see why he's not happy about having you punch him in the face. And I just got... I just got electrolytes everywhere. It's fine. I'm just making a mess. Oh my gosh. And trying to clean up the mess. I'm making more mess. Things are happening over here, guys. I'm swimming in electrolytes. It's fine. I'll just absorb them through my skin, right? That'll that'll do the trick. Oh my goodness. I have like a mess everywhere. Okay. Okay, guys. I just took a random electrolyte back. Damn, this is hard without allies. Yeah. <laughs> Having allies is, is does make it easier. make a torch. And I don't remember what it takes to even make the altar, so we're gonna have to look at that too. But it probably takes wood. So I'm gonna collect the wood that uh, has been knocked down down here. Apparently, accidentally get a plant and hurt my sanity. It's fine. Who needs to be sane? Ah, gosh. 
I don't, I don't need to attract any of that attention. You just stay right on the rabbits. Rabbit meat is great. Stay with them. Oh no, what's happening? Vergers coming to base. Oh well, all right. <laughs> We're just trading boss problems. It's gonna be that kind of don't starve night. It's fine. Badger is trashing Christmas, huh? He's like, screw this, guys. This holiday's over. We're months past it now. He's being a Scrooge, guys. I ran away from there. Don't know if he stayed or not. Hard to say. Badger doesn't tend to target, like, your objects the way that uh, Deerclops does. He tends to just look for food. Um, would you just like me to open our food box so that you don't like Or you just already emptied them all right Come here buddy Come on, you know you want this pumpkin come on get Badger to go away. Alright, and apparently there's just like assholes living over here. It's fine. I didn't need their attention. It's fine. All right. So what does it take? Uh, yeah. I, I don't remember anything that's happening in this world. I'm just sort of, you know, making it up as I go. Oh, I need one more gold. Ugh. All right, I guess I need to like go up here and get my beef and, and my corpse. There's way too many spiders here. I'm gonna have to like, I don't know, trigger badger and run him through the spiders and try to do that without like getting nerfed myself
There's too many! You are a mighty beef beef, but they, they are the many. They are the swarm. I just wanted to pick up my pile of gold. Come on, guys. Please do not nerf my beef. Can I not make my... I apparently cannot make my torch on a beef. All right, all right, that's fine. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I don't, it's not looking very promising that we're gonna get another boat event going. We've only got about a half an hour to achieve boatiness. But I'm gonna try. I just have to collect enough gold to be able to get the starter pack. That's like five. I can definitely do it with five, but I also have to have the like amount to make the altar to start with, which I think is eight. So I'm looking at like 12 or 13 gold. That's like, brrr. that's quite a big chunk in the beginning. And I have like nothing really stashed in this world. So there's that. Everything's fine guys, everything's fine. Oh no, there's this, the Celestial Champion is still here. I don't know that this world is better, guys. <laughs> I've forgotten that there's bosses roaming around in this world. There's, so we've got like three bosses roaming around this one. And in the other world, we've got one. Maybe the other world is our better bet after all. I, I, I don't know. He nerfed you before you got started. Awesome. Well, if nothing else, you may get an adorable little ghost. Run! <laughs> Don't look at me, sir. I'm not here. Definitely, definitely not here. I am not worthy of your time or attention. Do not worry about it. I am a lonely worm that does not really exist. It's fine. At least those bishops didn't feel the need to shoot my ass down. Because I am weenie enough that, like, looking at me sideways will nerf me at this point. If I can get there during the day... I think that I can sneak in and get my gold from the spiders. But I gotta not walk on the web, which requires me to pay way more attention than I have been. Uh, I need to go this way. Speaking of paying attention, Let's do our best not to ride on the nest. Come on, 
time. Let me pick up the gold. Please, please, please let me pick up the gold. Okay, I got like 20. That's that's gonna have to be gold enough. Okay. Huh. Let's let's eat some Christmas candies just to like I don't know, assage my, like, torment. I don't want to monster me. It's fine. Nothing, nothing's wrong here. Drop my poop. Get a little bit of sanity from planting some seeds. And we need that charcoal. dropped all the stuff that I need. I don't remember what I need, but I need something to make it. Just wood. Okay. I need to get my fire going. There we go. Okay. I don't know where I'm going to build that, but right at this moment, I'm going to get a fire going so that I don't, like, get nerfed by Charlie. So much poop everywhere. It's ridiculous! The mermans are attacking you? Oh goodness. My badger ate like all my food. guys look at that sexy sexy brown pants they actually look good with my outfit surely just read the last message i did you got two bodyguards that did nothing i had the boards by the tall bird if you want to go pick them up oh i have the thing Into Chester. Helps if I if I click the right buttons. Alright, and where do I want to build this? I think I want to come like over here. So that it's not in and amongst where all the hostilities are. But it means I'm going to probably want to build another fire pit. And probably carry some poop. So that we have... Some things to burn. Alright, and then we rock... Like no rocks. That's really rude. Okay. 
Alright, I should be able to get a couple more rock things and then... We can theoretically go down there, make a fire pit, so we'll have a light source. Yeah, I'm sure this is gonna go fine, guys. Everything, everything's gonna go just peachy. I just need some rocks at this point. I need 12 specifically. I mean, getting a little bit of extra gold out of it just definitely doesn't hurt anything. Okay. We're definitely running out of rock stuff that's not swarmed by the spiders. Everything's fine. It turned out just great. Dude, you're in the way. I gotta get into the box, bud. He's like, that's fine. Alright. Hey, and look, we got another bobble. eat the cookie now. It's fine. Alright, and then I need it. I don't need a sword. I need an axe. Okay. And we need the whole two wood. off to make an altar and I'm gonna make it over here so that it's away from like the spider kerfuffle Let's put down our fire pit. Let's cook our nuts. Yes, nuts roasting of an open fire. And then let's make our uh, put down our altar. And then let's give it its offering. And then, look guys, we can buy boat stuff.
see if I can get enough wood to make a uh, box. Because I didn't plan for a box. But a box seems like a good idea. I'm not going to get a box. Alright, that's fine. Actually, it's really not because uh, the moles will come and pick up my gold, which is what we absolutely need to keep. <sighs> the struggle's real, guys. But I'm going to get another boat out there gonna happen. It's going to happen. Spider just nerfed me. I got punched in the face by a spider. It was very rude. Even with the darkness not lasting for very long, it, it causes problems. Okay. So, Ads, you should pick up some gold so that you can buy some boat materials at the, uh, Alter. I think there's nine, which should be enough for you to buy a boat and some oars, because you won't need the uh, race starting point. You didn't see it. You mean the spider? Yeah. It took me a minute to figure out what was, like, getting me. I think I'm at, like, nine now, Uthgar. It's fine. Don't worry. I've died plenty. Deathing has happened. Oh, my God. A celestial guardian right there is so rude. It's fine. I thought this world would be better. I'm now not convinced. Decisions were made. Regrets were had. Whoop! He moved since last I saw him. Almost ran right to him. That is a nope, nope, nope. All the nope, nope, nopes. Nobody, nope, nope, nobody. Nope, 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 no. And this time, I'm not going on the boat with a torch. I'm just going to have to wait until daylight and go during daytime. Because, man, torches and boats, bad things happen. <laughs> and I don't have a lantern, so I'm just going to have to go during the day. And it's going to have to be good enough.
just gotta like collect all the things so I can find the things that I actually need. Back to where we were. Come on over here to the altar. You should be able to see the altar and the new uh, fireplace I have down here. On your map. You should be able to see it on the map. gold in the box for you ads all right let's try another adventure because what could possibly go wrong okay i'm gonna try i'm gonna try All right. Where's my arrow? And it's almost nighttime, so this is probably a bad idea to try right now, but here we are. The thing that I said would be a bad idea, I totally just went ahead and did it. Yeah, yeah, that, that happened, Ads. I... This is where things, like, happen in the planning world, and then when it comes time to really do the thing, I, I, I get distracted and lose track of what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, and we're getting winter time. All right, this is great. And then I froze. That's not nice. <laughs> I got my little packages, but I froze. <sighs> it's fine. And my boat will probably sink before I get my little packages. Guys, it didn't go good. I tried though. Boating is hard. <laughs> I will say though, this time around, boating did go better than it did with our first boat attempt. I, I've actually been able to like navigate it a little bit, so that's that's an improvement. Yeah, yeah, improvements. We'll we'll take the improvements we get. It's great. Let's see if I can drink without wearing it. That was also an improvement. Definitely troll behavior happening. 
You can claim innocence if you would like, but we all know better. Here we come a trolling. I'm also realizing that I'm going to need a stone. Now that I'm seeing that it is the winter time. So I'm going to need um, stone materials. I'm going to like take advantage of Berger like wrecking the place. Hi, Sagmus! How you doing? <laughs> so how's my night going? Well, I'm doing more successful with boating than I had been, so I'll take it. How about you? How are things going with you tonight? Internet issues, and I tried to click join, and you clicked on watch. <laughs> yeah, I saw that you uh, were asking to, to watch. I was like, all right, that's fine. Okay. Decide you're done with boating. That that That's valid. I headed to the wrong little niche. That's not our forest niche. I didn't want to eat that. I wanted to plant that. Because I need some sanity. Because I really don't want to be fighting spirits while I'm on my boat either. Did the server kick you? I don't think so. You can't hear you can't hear the zebra pig anymore. You can hear me? Hello. Can everybody else? still hear me or am I just talking to myself out here in the great abyss uh what does it take to make gold rock like 10 rock you can hear me on YouTube oh okay Just not in other realms. All right. Access denied, I guess. All right, some carnage has been happening in here. Oh, apparently I have some stones. All right, call it good then. All right, hopefully I can give it one more try here. And then, and then it'll be pumpkin time, but I'm sure, I'm sure that it will, will work. You can't join the game from your profile. Let me try and do it searching the server. I'm not sure why it does that sometimes. It gets moody. My boat, in fact, did sink. Oh, but at least I can still pick it up, it looks like. All right. I just have to be able to boat out to it. Which I am not going to start that at night. Look at me following the, my own rule that I have set. I'm going to sit here and I'm going to cook, and then I'm going to wait for the night time to pass, and then in the morning... We will go on the next sailing adventure. OK. 
Okay, let me get, we're gonna get a boat. All right, I need at least one ore. All right, now we have to play the waiting game and wait for the dangerous, like, dark time to pass. And then, so I can see, because I'm definitely not taking torches on my boat. And then, we can get the boat going. I think that I will try to get my oars and packs first. All right, we gotta wait out the night. Luckily, nighttime in this particular world is not that long, so. And then we'll give it one more go and it'll be whatever it is. got you Charlie Charlie nerfed you rip Charlie this is my fire bugger off you're not invited to the fire party okay let's see if we can get our stuff and then we'll try one more race. I find like changing directions is the biggest challenge. All right, let's get over here and get the race started. Boat, you gotta hold out for me. setting up blocks and I don't like it. I mean, I'm not beating it, beating the ghost, but at least I'm like meeting the objective. All right, and then let's see if we can get to shore. Look, we got, we got presents. We got presents. We successfully boated. There's some gold in the box you can buy your, your boat with if you would like to try a uh, boat adventure.
Oh, I shouldn't put these right next to the fire. That will just break them. I know better. But look, look, we got some stuff. You do have a boat? Oh, okay. And then we can get, like, more boat stuff. I don't know. We tried to get one nugget, but then everything happened. Everything happened. I feel that. Light your way with dragon fire. I don't know what all this stuff is, but... Claw anchor. So we want a mast. Ooh, that takes three... One person's bowie is another person's barrier. Yeah, that was definitely turning out to be the case. Celebrate with a bang! And getting a boat patch. And then maybe we can salvage this boat. No? Can you, can you, can you be re repair a leak? I don't, I don't think that that was sufficiently repaired. It would have been better, I think, just to uh, make a new boat. But now I feel like in for the penny, in for the pound. Dude. It takes a lot to fix your boat. That's good to know, I guess. Are you gonna stop leaking? No, it's just it's just gonna keep leaking. I'm just I'm just I'm fighting a lost cause. I think is what that is. Alright, I'm done fighting the lost cause. Alright, that was our boat adventure. We actually had some mediocre amounts of success, so woohoo! I'll take the win I can get. All right, but it is pumpkin time. So I am going to switch over to the other screen and we'll wrap things up because I am definitely a pumpkin now. So thank you everybody for coming and hanging out with me today and watching my boat misadventures. Uh, it definitely went better than the last boat adventure, so I will take the progress that we got. It, it feels like winning. If you are over on YouTube, you can find the links to all the things outside of the world of YouTube down in the description of the stream. And good night, YouTube. I uh, will hopefully see y'all tomorrow. You guys take care of yourselves. And over here...